we're announcing for the first time a new use case for audio AI based on the same technology that is currently aboard the ISS. Together with Highmark Health in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, we're exploring the use of audio AI as a diagnostic tool in pediatric medicine. Specifically, we're working on adapting these experimental sensors to detect pulmonary conditions such as asthma at an early age just by listening to children's breathing patterns. Welcome to the stage, Dr. Joseph Arakri. Joe is the chair of pediatrics for the Allegheny Health Network within the Highmark Health portfolio. Hi, Joe. Hey, Mike. Joe, we're talking a lot about the impact of technology to provide a positive benefit to our lives. Why was a technology like audio AI of interest to you, and what important things do you think you can learn from? Thanks, Mike. I'm so excited to be part of this research. Our hypothesis is that each kid has a sort of audio fingerprint, and that audio AI can be used to learn the child's normal pulmonary sounds. Should something change, then the idea is that the AI will pick up what has changed and potentially lead to earlier therapies and better outcomes. Mm -hmm. Very impressive. So Joe, basically audio AI can provide us with some of the same insights that you get when you listen to someone's chest? We're actually hoping it'll be better than a stethoscope. Ideally, this technology will enable us to monitor kids in a non-invasive manner and alert the parents at a far earlier stage when there's a variation from the child's baseline. Wow. And you can also tell the kids that this technology came from space, mm -hmm. too. <laughs> Using innovative technology to improve children's health. That's exactly what we mean when we say high-tech like a Bosch. Thank you, Joe, and good luck. Thanks, Mike. Great to see you. Yeah.